Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily and I talk a lot about Salesforce. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to report on your stage duration history. So let's go ahead and jump into reports over here. All right, and then go to new report. And then you're gonna to wanna to go to uh, opportunity record type and then have it be opportunity history record type. All right, go ahead and start report. All right, so now this is typically what you see. I like to update the preview automatically, but there might be a lot of data. So just depending on how you like having your report. Personally, I like to update the preview automatically. I'm going to reset some of my filters so then I can see more data and you can see what's going on. How to do this, so with the opportunity report history or history report, you can the most recent change of what stage it was from and what stage it went to. I might switch these around just so that it makes a little bit more sense. There we go. And I just created this org, so it is filled with a lot of test data. So you can see it went from closed lost to closed lost in my test data here. One of the more important things I've got is we can also show the duration. So let's go ahead and add stage duration here. Let's go ahead and move it over to the after the two stage field. Okay, that's not working. Let's go ahead and move it this way. Um, just so that it makes a little bit more sense. It's showing that it's a negative 2,549 days. I'm sure that's just a trailhead org error with the data. And this is kind of how you report on stage duration. You can see how long it was in each or was in the last stage and where it is now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and save and run this. And unfortunately, there's not a great way to see how long um, it was in each stage. Although if you'd like to see a workaround of that, let me know in the comments down below and I'll be happy to go ahead and make that project with you guys. So if you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a like, subscribe. You can check out the courses down below or on salesforceupscale.com. You can connect with me on LinkedIn and Twitter at Emily Call MBA. Thank you so much and I'll catch you guys in the next one.